to a trailhead now and she starts, you know, that puppy whine. She's ready to go. And it gets all excited and is ready to get out, run around. She's nothing but a wad of muscle up on the front <laughs> right now. She has a five second pop, like when it comes to stairs or any obstacle, where you can tell she's contemplating it. And then she just completely commits to going. That is a challenge with her is we gotta keep an eye on her because she's not afraid of much at this point. <laughs> she's just like any other puppy. She's rambunctious. She is full of energy. She just wants to go all the time. She wants to try about anything that we put in front of her. As far as we can tell, we don't notice anything with her that she recognizes her deficit, which I think is pretty amazing. Both being physical therapists, that's part of what made us want to take that challenge on. We work with humans who are dealing with similar injuries and we get to watch them overcome deficits. And so I think that plays a huge part in what we're able to provide Noodle is that you know, we're able to help guide her in doing what she wants to do. We wanted to see what it would be like to have a little bit more of a challenge. And it honestly really hasn't been that much of a challenge once we got into it. There, there was some learning curve a little bit. It's like we adopted inspiration in some ways because she's flying through the house without use of her back legs. And I'm like, all right, I need to shut up and kind of get going and do my day. We've learned which ones are wide enough for her scooter and which ones aren't. <laughs> so like Kyle said, it's kind of a learning curve. But it's amazing. She's really learned her parameters of how wide and big she is with her wheels on. First inclines were a big challenge, but she's gotten so strong now that we rarely run into one that she can't tackle. She's completely a water dog, which has become a challenge because if we get her anywhere close to water, she focuses only on that. It's funny, when we first got her, one of the first couple of times we took her for a walk, she didn't want to venture away from the home. She would only go like a block or so. And now she's grown to being this dog that wants to go everywhere. And she's more upset if she, we don't take her with her on any of our ventures that we go on. Being physical therapists, we just think about adaptability. When you have a handicap, you can always find a way to make it work. It just may not look the way you thought it was going to. Noodles become our daily inspiration. As we age and we wake up and we feel a little creak in the knee, you just look down at this cute little dog and she has no issues and she's ready she's, to roll. She's really just as happy as can be.